In this video, we'll see how to work on the tables, some more few features. This is the table part two topic. Now, what are the topics I'll be covering? If you see this yellow color highlighted, how do we insert rows and columns? How do we cut, copy, paste rows and columns? And how do we delete rows, columns and uh, table itself? So let us see that. If I'll scroll down, I've created a table here. Uh, I've written some data, employee ID, names, age, days and amount, some data I've written here. Now the very first thing is if I want to insert a row and a column, anything. So I'll start if I want to insert a row, how I can insert? It's simple. I can just click on this place. You know, if I have a mouse, how I can do it? I can just click on this plus button. So if I click on the plus button, a row will be inserted between this A35 and A95. You observe here, I'll click on this plus sign. Yeah, so a row is inserted, blank row is inserted between those. Similarly, if I want to insert a row between this uh, column, uh, what do you call it? column heading and here, so I'll just click on this place and I'll click on this plus sign. So this way it can be inserted. If I want to, if I do not want, I can just say it's undo, undo. So it will be removed. So this is how you can insert a row. If you want to insert a row, insert a column. Uh, column when you have a mouse, you can do the same way. You can just keep your cursor at this place like this using mouse and you can just click on this plus sign. So you just move your mouse and you'll get that arrow key like this. You just move your mouse and you'll get that kind of arrow key here. Like this and you can click on this plus sign. So if you do not want, you can just press control Z. If you want, you can, you know, bring it back itself. Now, this was how you insert rows and columns. Now there's one more method using the menu bar or you can see as the tabs. How do you insert? Simple method. I'll just keep my cursor in this names column. If I want to insert a column before this, okay, insert a column before this column, I can go to this layout tab and you see that is nothing but rows and columns. I want to insert above, below. I want to insert above and below. No, I want to insert on the left hand side. So I'll just click on this insert left. You observe what will happen. So insert left, a left column will be inserted. Similarly, if I keep my cursor here and if I want to insert a column on the right hand side, so I'll just click on this insert right. So you observe how it is done. So this is how we can insert a column on the left and right. Now you want to delete the empty columns. How you can do that? You can just select this way. So you can use your mouse and select control click. I have selected the entire column. You see you have to use this mouse, this arrow key. When you get this down arrow key kind of, you can select this columns. And then if you want to delete, you see in the layout, Okay, in the layout, you might find this option. Okay, anyways, you can just keep your cursor, the other method, just keep your cursor, go to this delete and you can select as delete columns. So if I click on this delete columns, see what will happen. This column where my cursor was there got deleted. If I click on this place, select this delete columns, it went back, right? There's one more method when you have a mouse, you can just select this way, entire column, right click, right click and you can see as cut or you can see as delete columns one and the same method you can see as delete columns so this way columns got deleted now similarly if you want to delete rows how you delete how you delete it similarly i'll select this entire row like this okay so i've selected entire row and i can right click and delete this way right click and i can see as delete rows this method so the row which is given here will be deleted. So this row got deleted. Other method is if you want to delete rows by this method, you can select that like this. Okay. So you just keep your cursor in this any cell number. You do not have to select and then you can go to this delete and I say you can see as delete rows. So this 828 will get deleted. So you see delete rows 828 got deleted. So this way you can insert columns. I've shown you how to insert columns before and after how to delete rows and columns. There's one more thing. How do you insert rows, right? Suppose I have my cursor in A35. I want to insert a row above that. So you can use this option as insert above. So if I click on insert above, a row will be inserted here. I'll click on insert above. You see here. Similarly, if I keep my cursor at A35, I want to insert a row below that. So I can just click on this below option, right? So this is the method by which you can paste it right so a rows and columns can be inserted by the long cut and the shortcut method also let us see the next one if i want to cut copy and paste how do i do that so i'll first show you cut and paste right 
So how do I you know cut the first column that is employee ID I have want to cut it and paste on the right hand side. So simple is like you have to first select the column here you can select this column here then you can use the option in the home tab as cut okay or you can press control X right or else you can right click any of the method either click on this place or press control X or you can just right click. So I'll just use the mouse right click say as cut. So from here it has been cut and I want to paste it on the right hand side. So I'll just right click here and I'll say as paste. You see once I click on that paste a column will be inserted. So this way it is cut paste right cut paste. So I'll just resize it. Okay, I'll, I'll just go to this layout tab and I'll see as distribute rows like this. Yeah, now it's better. So what I've done is I've copied, I mean, I've cut and pasted on the right hand side. Similarly, if I want to copy paste, how do I do that? So I'll just select this column here. Okay, right click on this column. Okay, right click on this column and say as copy. And if you want to paste here, similarly, if you want to paste in this place, just right click and say as paste. So I'll just right click and say as paste column. So this way copy paste is done. You can see copy paste. Same applies for rows also. Rows you can cut copy paste similarly, right? So I hope you are able to understand. The last one I have left with how do I delete the entire table. Deleting entire table is simple. You can just go to this layout tab, click on this delete. And you can see there's an option as delete table. So the entire table will go away. So I'll just click on this delete and the table gone away. So I hope you have understood how to work with inserting rows and columns, how to cut copy paste and how to, you know, uh, work with this delete rows, columns and entire table. So that's all for this video.